ATK and NASA successfully tested the Ares 5-segment solid rocket motor Tuesday, August 31st at 9.27 a.m. The test was important to the company's future and a milestone for the next generation of launch vehicles. The motor burned for 125 seconds and produced about 3.6 million pounds of thrust. This success is a testament to how well ATK and NASA's teams are able to stay on primary objectives. The team is creating a new capability in terms of power and performance. Utah Senator Orrin Hatch. We depended upon uh, Russia uh, to get our people to space. More importantly, solid rocket motors are needed to get us beyond the world. It is very important that we keep this facility going. During this test, ATK collected more data than any previous static fire test while accomplishing 53 test objectives through 764 instrumentation channels. Data will be evaluated to better understand the performance and reliability of the design. ATK Vice President Charlie Precourt complimented the ATK and NASA teams for their professionalism and ability to perform under uncertain times. Do the guarantee jobs or alleviate stress within the next year? Well, I think it's a, a strong compliment to the skills of this workforce. Uh, as I mentioned, uh, you don't achieve harnessing 3.6 million pounds of thrust of energy uh, the way these folks did. Uh, without having uh, extreme amounts of engineering discipline, uh, know-how, smarts, and experience. And uh, so this workforce is very precious not only to us here in Utah, but to the nation. I think the workforce is to be congratulated for what they've achieved, and we expect that they'll have uh, a lot of continuing opportunities to do more of this. Uh, we're very uh, you know, enthused about what we did today. After the test, Kent Rominger, ATK Test and Research Operations, discussed the importance of this rocket motor. We've the most capable rocket motor in the world sitting right here. They, we're working it's probably the most reliable as well. It can only help the job. State Senator Peter Knutson. The success of the program depends on the success of these tests. And, uh, you know, we have uh, every opportunity right now to show the nation that uh, uh, ATK and solid rocket motors is the way of the future, not, of, not just in the past. Had uh, a lot of uh, attention uh, from the eastern part of our country regarding uh, this issue, and uh, I think that this, uh, this today just strengthens, strengthens our, our resolve to make sure rocket, uh, solid rocket motors uh, are. Uh, are not. This test was successful, but there is uncertainty of what the future may hold and doubt for the Constellation program. The next test is scheduled a year from now and will be a hot temperature test of the Development Motor 3. Dennis Tolman, a 20-year employee of ATK, said, I've seen a lot of these tests, but everyone is like the first time as far as excitement, pride, and anticipation. Reporting for the Tree Mountain Leader, this is Jessica Tanner.